a really cool plight. Jerry wrote it three years ago, but it's it's 50% avant pop. It's hard to describe. It's 50% avant pop, 50% Sam Shepard meets Arthur C. Clarke. We spoon fed it to him. The night he was going around town pitching our idea back to other networks. Do that. The guy's sly. I mean, he actually has his secretaries write his scripts for him. What I'm saying is it's very difficult to come to these parties, right? And everybody's talking about work. What, the normal fucking life? Yeah. You know? I'd like to think that I have a really rich civilian life. I'd like to think you do too. You know? Most definitely, yeah. So tell me, what are your passions? My passions, um, everything I do. Everything? Hey, would you excuse me for a second? Uh, no, I won't. I won't. You blew me off for dinner, you don't call me, I gave you my card. You're now obligated to stand here and give me five minutes. <laughs> You're coming back, right? 10% naked girls. Jerry. Jerry, 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 tell how great the play is. It's great. Tell me about your improv group that you're in. What is that like? So you're not Jerry yet? No. Is he here? Oh, yes, yes. He's here, but he's he's really shy. He's probably sort of you know, hiding in a corner somewhere. Mm. Busy. Hey, Jerry, let me in, will you? Come on, open the door. Mr. Chompers. Don't be an asshole. Come on. You know nobody can write this shit you write straight. You owe me a taste. Stop stabbing at me, yes! This isn't funny! No wonder you don't write for me anymore! You don't understand the basics of comedy! Comedy! Fucking junkie! No! No! Sound the one that we the, the, the came up with the other day, that great sound was like you know. <laughs> it wasn't that.